Caravan Salon 2024, Düsseldorf, Germany. The interest in caravanning remains exceptionally high. The great enthusiasm for independent and nature-oriented travel is also palpable at this year's Caravan Salon. 778 exhibitors from 35 countries are showcasing all types of leisure vehicles, equipment and accessories in Düsseldorf. In addition to RVs, motorhomes, caravans and camper vans, the offerings include large mobile homes, tents and tourism destinations, as well as camping and parking facilities. The development of the leading trade show in the caravanning sector is impressive. The record numbers of the previous year have been surpassed and with over 250,000 square meters of exhibition space, it is the largest caravan salon of all time, as all 16 exhibition halls and the outdoor space are fully booked. The 10-day event is clearly set to attract over a quarter of a million visitors from 69 countries this year. The long history of caravanning in Germany began in 1931 with the first German caravan, then called Living Car, constructed by ski pole manufacturer Aris Detlefs for his fiancée. Even today Detlefs is one of the leading manufacturers with its own hall. With the first motorhome, Caravano, Heimer showcased pioneering spirit back in 1961 and will also present interesting vintage models from the Heimer Museum at the show. Additionally, all types of motorhomes and caravan models will be featured. Meanwhile, the Irvin Heimer Group has become the number one in the German leisure vehicle market. Knaus Tabert also boasts a history of over 80 years and performs comparably well in sales figures. At the show it even appears to be the largest provider with various models currently available. With brands like Knaus, Tabert, Weinsberg, Tab and the rental brand Rent and Travel, which has 74 rental stations throughout Germany, they occupy nearly two exhibition halls. Notably, there is already some engagement with the topic of electromobility here. However, the majority of models are still designed for use with combustion engines. Nonetheless, one can clearly see the different categories of mobile vehicle offerings. Alongside nearly all sizes of caravans, there are various classes of motorhomes. Camper vans, for example, can be individually and efficiently converted from various van models into motorhomes. The next step includes semi-integrated models such as the Weinsberg Edition Pepper, which offers a bit more space while still fitting within the category of motorhomes under 3.5 tons. Above this class, there's fully integrated vehicles, which are offered not only by Knaus Tabert. The largest variants are full buses that even offer space for car garages for a small smart or even a vintage car or sports car. However, interest is also high in the halls of Morello and Concord, although very few will likely be able to afford these vehicles. As base models for the vans and semi-integrated vehicles, the industry utilizes models from the Stellantis group, including Fiat, Citroën, Peugeot and Opel, and increasingly the VW Crafter or Mercedes-Benz Sprinter. Volkswagen commercial vehicles showcases various offerings with the California motorhomes, ranging from the classic VW bus to a small compact caddy and the Crafter versions, such as the Grand California. Naturally, many other brands and providers are also represented, and one notable observation is the presence of off-road motorhomes with different all-wheel drive concepts, from large trucks to camper vans and pickup models. This market appears to be growing significantly, although some models might struggle to navigate larger slopes. Since the first caravan salon, which took place in 1962 at the Messe Essen, the world's leading trade show for mobile leisure, now hosted in Düsseldorf, has undergone impressive development. Exhibitors and visitors are eagerly awaiting the upcoming next year's event of the world's largest caravanning trade show.